Hi Taurus, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your another reading for September. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. This is going to be, you know, you and the other person. So there's going to be two sides. You pick which side is yours. Okay? And that same go thing goes for the cross watcher. Now, these readings, every reading that I do tend to resonate with people that need them the most. Okay? So, let's just see what comes up for Taurus for September. For them and the person that they are thinking about, okay? So, you're thinking about somebody right now. Oh, jeez, I'm crying. I don't think I'm thinking about anybody. If you're not thinking about anybody, well, we'll just see what comes up. We'll see if somebody's coming in or whatever. Um, what do we got for Taurus? What do we got for Taurus? Oh, there it is. Uh-oh. Romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. So, romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. Okay. All right. So, somebody's feelings are real, right? And this is basically saying you should go for it. You should go for it. So, let's see. Let's see what we got here for Taurus. Looks like there's some sort of connection, for sure. There is some sort of connection. A pretty deep one. It looks like it's a passionate connection to me. Um, you may be even taken aback by it. You may be taken aback by it. There's somebody that you probably don't realize. Five of Cups reversed. You, it's like you may be beginning to realize that there is somebody else because this is getting over a loss the five of cups reverse somebody's getting over a loss this is a missed opportunity this person may be feeling at a loss feeling discontent hmm. ooh the emperor reversed angry this person may be angry upset that they lost an opportunity so somebody may be upset that they are lost an opportunity or they didn't take an opportunity or something like that i mean this the emperor in reverse is upset angry and this is a lost opportunity Six of Swords reverse. Reluctant to take a new approach. Strength, confidence, healing. Somebody has found the strength to let go of a troublesome situation. Focusing on something else. We got somebody over here that is focusing on themselves. No chance. No chance in reconciliation. This person is like, there's no chance. There's no chance. I want somebody else. I want somebody else. This person has healed. This person is like, there's no chance of going back to that troubled situation. This person is angry. Whew, the moon. The truth is, this is the truth. The truth has been revealed. Somebody is getting the truth, okay? And they're angry about it. Somebody is angry that they have lost a relationship. This person is upset that they didn't focus on a relationship when they should have. Now, I mean, with the moon reversed, this is the truth. The truth is, the truth is, there's no relationship here. They were probably narcissistic or they were controlling, you know, and now they've lost a relationship. So this person has lost some sort of relationship. That's what this is, too. And that is the truth. So, what else do we got here? Something is being revealed. There's a loss. There is some sort of loss here. Whatever this loss is, now, this loss doesn't have to be a lover, okay? I'm just going to be honest with you here. This loss could be of, you know, <laughs> this is a father, 
this is a husband this is somebody that is very dominant in your life somebody that is very controlling somebody that is manipulative somebody that is very bossy okay this is a loss though okay it's a loss of a relationship but this loss is going to lead to a new opportunity a new passionate opportunity that's what this is okay a new this is this is a new romantic exciting opportunity so there could be somebody that is coming in with some sort of emotional support this is somebody different than this loss it is it's somebody different so we have somebody here that is <laughs> experiencing a loss but this loss is going to bring them something you know romantic which is crazy I know but that's what we got this is romance and passion and that this is romance and passion if you look at that card so we have somebody over here that may not be looking for love maybe this person's angry this could be you this could be this person whoever this person is angry this person is like you know I'm not focused on a relationship and here it comes here it comes so this person does have somebody coming in that they probably don't even want and they don't they're not even looking for yeah ace of cups reversed this person is feeling at a loss this person is probably feeling like they can't open up to love but I feel like we have somebody here that is wanting them to you know open their heart so I feel like we have this person over here that is shutting down emotionally, shutting down their feelings, not wanting a relationship, but they have somebody that is trying to get them to start something with them. Um, I, there is some sort of truth or some sort of something that has been hidden that is about to be revealed, okay, with the moon reverse. It does have to do with a relationship that is probably ended because this is the end of something. Uh, this is a family, for some of you, this is a family situation with the Ten of Cups reversed. Let's go back over here. This person is working hard at healing. This person is working hard at bringing in abundance into their life. 888. 888 is extremely abundant. It's infinity as well. What goes around comes around. It's limitless, limitless abundance. So this per person is working hard at moving forward. They don't want a reconciliation. This person doesn't want a reconciliation from somebody that is not emotionally available. So this person over here is working on themselves. And they are reluctant to communicate with anybody. So this person is reluctant to communicate. They're reluctant to give anybody a chance. This person is beginning to realize that there's other opportunities. But they are reluctant to communicate this is reluctance they're reluctant to you know put in effort into any kind of uh person it's like they don't trust it's like no i'm i'm good i'm i'm really good i'm really good this person is beginning to realize but they're still healing and they've done a lot of healing and they're not ready to uh I don't think this person is ready to get in any sort of relationship and I feel like this person isn't quite ready because they're, they're doing so well on their own. This person is really, really working on their abundance and they're not um, wanting to, you know, go back to or bring any sort of trouble into their life. I think this person was probably dealing with somebody who was emotionally unavailable and they just are like, you know what? I'm, I'm too strong. I'm strong. This person has gained a lot of strength through pain this person was left behind this person was um, left behind for another person and hurt this person was hurt this person was hurt and now this person has found their self-confidence to pick themselves up so I feel like this person is not in any hurry whatsoever to get into any kind of relationship 
That's what we got here. This person is very confident, very strong, very, very strong, very, very... Um, This person is forceful. This is a force to be reckoned with. This person has really refound themselves. It's like they got this new vision of a, you know, happier future. This person is really focused on the future. And they're reluctant to give anybody a chance. It's like there's no chance. This person is so strong that they don't even trust. It's like, a no, it's, and they don't trust because they've been deceived by somebody who didn't know how to love wasn't open emotionally and this person probably involved another person <laughs> and now and now there's 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 no looking back there's no looking back it's like there's no forward movement so i feel like this person is totally focused on the future there's no chance for reconciliation. There's no chance of even moving into a relationship. This is what this person thinks. This person is so strong so strong this person is not wanting wanting to deal with any conflict not wanting to deal with any any um oh opposition this person is it has their guard up okay this person is really focused on themselves really really focused on themselves in a good way in a really good way now let's go back over here but I feel like there's something that somebody, see, this is, there's no chance, but it's like this person wants a chance. So I feel like this person wants a chance. And this could, there could be like an instant attraction. There could be something that happens suddenly. This person is feeling like, you know, why, why won't this person accept me? Why won't this person give me a chance? Well, I have to tell you that this person won't give you a chance because they were dealing with somebody that, um, was cold this person was was withdrawn this person didn't follow through this person you know they didn't have success with whoever the last person was and i feel like now this person has gained so much strength through a painful situation that they're just they they feel like they don't need anybody that's what that is. It's like no, I don't want to move forward with anybody. I'm going. I'm. 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 I'm just fine. I'm fine by myself. This person is very, very determined to be the boss, to be successful, and they're not focused on any sort of relationship right now. And I feel like we have somebody over here that is upset because they want this person to give them a chance, and it's not being accepted. This person is coming in with an opportunity and, or an offer. You know, this person wants a relationship. And it's like it's being turned down. And that's what's making this person upset. This person wants a relationship. But this person is not even interested. Um, yeah, see? The Nine of Pentacles reversed. Some, it's like this person doesn't want to be single anymore. This person is absolutely looking for a relationship. They're, they they see an opportunity. It's like they see this attractive, you know, it's very attractive to them. And this, it, it's like their offer of love isn't being accepted. And it's because this person isn't ready to give up their independence or this person is too afraid. This person is afraid. There's fear. This is fear of the chariot reversed. There's fear. <laughs> oh god seven of cups this is this is a complex decision this is uh, this is options there's choices a chance this person is thinking about i think this person is thinking about what they can do this person is thinking about what should I do now? What should I do? This is confused. This person is confused about, I think, being rejected. I don't think this person is used to rejection. This person may think, well, geez, this is a poor decision.
this person is probably going to be very upset. This person is going to be very upset. This person is upset that they are not being given a chance. I feel as though... This person is going to have a hard time accepting that they are not being given a chance. I know that I keep repeating myself. What's this person going to do? This person is going to is is going to is going to try again. This person is going to keep trying. This person is going to is going to, you know, make some sort of big offer and they're going to they're going to do everything. They're going to they're going to really try hard. To get this person to bring break their walls down to to open up. This person is really going to focus on getting this person to open up. Okay? I think we got we have an Aries over here. We could have a Pisces or a Cancer. We could have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We could have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. This person is is not happy this person is angry and upset and even sad because this person will not even consider them and I feel like this person is going to really try hard to get this person to give them a chance to break down their walls they see it they see it as a as a as a some sort of this is meant to be this is a very it is and I think this is going to happen suddenly I think that there's going to be an instant attraction a sudden attraction you may not know this person I feel like this is probably somebody that you don't expect that is the meaning this is an unexpected choice in love so I feel like, uh, Taurus, you are going to probably have this unexpected opportunity for love. <laughs> There's like this instant attraction that comes your way that you're not even looking for. You've been trying to avoid it. But there is some sort of connection here. There is. It looks like it's a soulmate connection. It looks like it's sudden. It's very, very sudden. You don't know who it is. I don't think you know who it is. You haven't seen this person yet. So, yeah, I don't think you know who this person is. Um, if you do know who this person is, I don't think you do. I don't think you do. I think this person, they may be watching you. Or once they meet you, once they once they see you, they're going to start watching you. They're going to really, really want you to give them a chance. This could happen around the 16th. I don't know where that time came from. Um, but I feel like we have somebody over here who's quite confident. They're on their own. They're happy. They're not looking. And here we go. We got somebody that is coming in. Could be a Gemini. I think if there's an unexpected opportunity coming your way that you absolutely do not see coming, uh, Mike, uh, Mike, go for it. That's my advice. Go for it. Good luck. 